So hey there and welcome to channel the way this is Adwit Mandeshwar and it's in this particular section of video I'm going to tell you how to uh, just upload with FTP so in the last video I, I told you this uh, script installer method in this particular video I'm going to tell you the normal FTP method that I had promised in the last video so I did not get much time in the previous two three weeks so I was not able to do it so but in this particular video I'm going to tell you the same so first thing is I'm going to download HTML5 template from HTML5.net. I have mentioned the link in the description. So this is the theme I'm going to use Arial. I would just download this quickly because this is a very short theme and there is no much editing required. Like just edit the name and it's done. Okay, so it's done. Now it's downloaded. Just uh, I would just drag and drop it on the desktop. Right click, extract to HTML5 up dash Arial. So you see this theme, this theme index.html So you see this theme, this is very simple theme Just right here to show you I would be just editing this uh, things at this uh, top title sections Sorry for that and save go we refresh and that's a bit of sure web developer channel with as simple as that and you can edit all of these uh, later so i won't be just getting into this all technicality in this video since it's just an ftp video not uh, the technicality video so you see here you i have downloaded win scp i have mentioned the link in the description this is their official site right here and you just need to download this portable executables file and then uh, you'll get a zip and extract the zip and you'll get this one winfcp.exe just open this up and then you need to click on this new site then protocol is FTP and then encryption is TLS SSL okay then go on your cPanel X just right here you see this is the FTP hostname. Copy this FTP hostname. Put it here. Then copy this username. Put it here. Then the password is actually the password you have set during the time of registration. Make sure you have watched my previous video, otherwise, you won't get what I'm telling you on this one. Now you can save this, but since I already saved this one, I won't save it again. And then log in. After you have done this, this would take you to the directly listing you need to go to channel channel.html like I have my main domain over there stdocs and then this is a blank empty folder so you need to upload all of these files which I have edited right here so there is a trick I am going to tell you don't upload this directly just don't drag and drop this right here because it would take a lot of time what you can do is go on this folder right click add to archive zip ok I did not recommend that method because uh, FTP has its own process of uploading each and every file separately again and again so it would just consume a lot of time because it's upload it just regenerates speeds after every single file upload while when you upload a zip it just gets uploaded within 5 to 10 seconds not more than that depending upon your internet connection like that so I have, I have just uh, very fast uploaded this one and after I have actually uploaded this one, I would go into my cPanel X. You see this in this files, you have your online file manager. Just hit this one. Then it would open your online file manager. Then you need to just uh, navigate into channel upgrade.ml like your stdocs folder where you are, are managing the main stdocs uh, documents. And then you see the zip file is already ready over here. Just select this. Just check this up then unzip this file yes I would like to unzip this file and then you have unzipped this now go onto your website just to check whether you have actually done the work you were supposed to 
and this is done you have successfully uploaded your file onto your domain so that's all for this video guys thank you